Alright guys, it's your boy Mr. 75 Capizzi with another video and today my friends we are on our way to go check out a 1968 Buick Skylark similar to the one that we had before um, I'm actually with my partner right here you guys can see him I don't know why he chose to go in this condition of weather because it's pretty ugly out here guys it's like uh, rainy and you guys know I hate to buy cars in the rain because you cannot see like the full effect of the car you can't see like any imperfections or any of their bad stuff so I'm hoping that the guy has a garage or shop or something if not we're gonna have to go like by a gas station so we can see it or I don't know so hopefully we don't make a bad decision with this one uh, the guy said it was pretty clean for the most part. It did have like a small imperfection, which he told me about it. So besides that, I'm hoping that it is a clean car. And hopefully it is what he says, you know, because otherwise I would have stayed home. It's pretty bad out here, guys. It's like raining. I don't know if y'all can see. Yeah, that's pretty bad. So um, we've been around. We've been seeing nothing but accidents. So this trip became from an hour and a half to like a three hour drive so or at least that's what it felt like so but yeah i think we're about 15 minutes out so we're about to uh pull up on the guy and uh see what it is uh we have no umbrella so we're probably gonna get wet you got your umbrella yeah no. you ain't got no umbrella just the hoodie you're gonna get wet bro yeah, yeah. you got shoes today or you got flip-flops i actually got shoes today okay at least you're prepared. This guy be coming out in flip flops and all types of stuff. Gotta be comfortable, you know? Yeah, be comfortable, but what about when it's rain, cold, you know? Like. Yeah, don't be outside too long. Uh -huh. But yeah, guys, we'll check back once we get to the car and hopefully uh, it's something nice. Alright, gang, we made it where the car is at, and unfortunately, it's outside. I don't know why they didn't he just pull it in that port right there. Can y'all see it? Uh, uh, uh. Ah, there you go. Good thinking, Gus. Damn, it sucks that it's raining. I still don't get why didn't he just pull it in that little thing right there. You see I'm that? He's down there in there. Huh? <laughs> it's like, I know, right? Might as well just back it up a little bit. Yeah. Looks good from right here. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Looks like all original and stuff. Yeah, yeah let's give him a call. Maybe he got some food in there for us, too. It's closed. It's closed? So February 23. Oh. Alright, well. Guess we gonna get wet. Did you turn it on me? There we go. We did a restaurant on it years ago. The frame looks like that, like the wheel belts. That's how fucking clean it is. I mean, it's probably worth 20 grand. Uh, this is a clean fucking car. And there's a little bubble on that other side over here. didn't have the skirts oh it's 
at the dices. Bling bling. Lights work. Oh yeah, they work. What's the mileage on here? Fifty-seven thousand. See how the floors feel. Well, they don't seem like they're weak. Uh, let's go check out this motor. Why they break out a lot? Yeah, my newer ones do. My older ones don't. My newer ones do. Yeah, they're, they're good investments. I mean, that's that's my personal truck. That's why I don't have a number on it. Yeah, I don't I don't tow for people. Unless I, I don't really tow for people unless I know them. So yeah, this is mine. Yeah, that's why we do personal. Yeah. The whole car. Yeah, I don't really you know I can't I'm not really available like for people to call me 24 seven you know yeah. for a tow. Yeah, that's me. A 92 Corvette? Yeah, that one's in the south right now. And the one I have over there is my 74 charger is probably bigger than this. Oh, you got a 72 charger? Yeah, I ain't got the motor in that one yet. You open the trunk? Yeah, and then I see the ground that comes off and it looks like it's just like it's painted it open like it's painted off. So they probably don't have a good ground. That was a light? You got a light on the side? Yeah. Were those did they come like that? Yeah. Oh. I don't know if my other one. Last year. I didn't I don't know if the my other one had this. There you go. Cool, right? oh, yeah. Nice. I don't, I don't I don't remember. I don't think so. Really hate to see the car in the rain. Like I, there's orange peel in the paint. That one side I, is I showed them is the bad side. But I mean, if you crawl underneath it, the whole the whole underneath the car is this. Um, it's, it's that they like painted it, right aligned it. It's beautiful. Little little bitty shit like they must put the bumpers on. It looks just a little off. Kind of hard to tell. What they put like this dino mat thingy? Like yeah, that's what it looks like. yeah, underneath there, yeah. Can't even really feel the quarters. Uh. <laughs> I want to take such a back go about uh. Oh uh, no, I didn't pay that much for it. No. I bought a used, yeah. I actually bought it from an auto mechanic. Oh, that's why I said I think the size, the rest of it's got the orange. No, I keep checking these auctions out, trying to see if I can get one. Auction. Yeah, it looks like a single stage. And then there's orange peeling, you know, like I told him, I said, a, a good wet sand is probably what got skipped on this one was a wet sand and a good buffing. What the, the only bad thing with single states, you got to have someone to really know what he's doing. Cause 
being a single stage, you can burn it through uh, pretty yep, easy. Sure so. can. But there's enough little repairs in it, you know, in here, little dings and stuff that. Does the top work? Yeah, top works great. I got a video of it. If you want a video, it won't do it here. You think it'll do it here? It's pretty. Well, I mean, we can open it a little bit if you want. Yeah, just to see, make sure it works. I just don't hit nothing. Right I got a video. You want to see video of it? <laughs> I really just see it live. Why it goes high? No, it doesn't go that high. It'll go high, but I don't. I think it'll be fine. Yeah, cause it'll it'll start bending down before yeah. it even get to that. Got it all on, huh? Uh, wrong way. Oh, wrong way. <laughs> yeah, you almost had a foot there. Oh, shit. covers in the back here. I didn't want to bring it all the way down right here. Oh, okay. I threw it back in there, so that's your cover. That when it covers all when it's all the way down in there. Yeah, yeah, you just put it. Throw it over, yeah. but I got it draped in there and it was starting to fold out. Gotcha. Yeah. Got it down all the way. Well, I'll see if uh, Gus wants to take it for a test drive. Don't look bad of a shape for being a 68. Looks like it could use a, a buff job. But it does look presentable. Uh, let's see if we can go on a test drive, guys. Alright, we're gonna go on a test drive. I'm just gonna let Gus take it for a spin. No. See he fails the test. Hopefully he don't. I know it's a little dark over here guys, so I don't know why it's so dark. All right, gang, the 1968 Buick Skylar going back with us. This is the guy that made it happen. Shout out to him. Sold me a nice car. Is it a nice car? It's a nice car. See, he sold me a nice car. So now we're going to load it up. Too big for me. Too big. He said he likes Corvettes, right? That's all you like, Corvettes? No, you know, I do have Mopar hanging around too, though. Like I said, my charger is probably as big as that. Yeah. Probably got a longer hood. My charger got a longer hood than that, my old 74. <laughs> but you said this one's too quiet, right? It's not too loud? Yeah. I don't know, it had a good sound to it. But... It needs a bigger motor. It got a 350 in it, doesn't it? Uh, yeah, more? That's good. And turn the lights on. Let's see if he knows. It's the two buttons on the right. There they are. There you go. There you go. You gotta turn the p. You got yeah. How long have you been collecting? 
Uh, I don't know. Since I was in high school, 07. Or, or, or older than that. 07. You wanna? Yeah, it's been a while. How many cars you got? How many cars I got? I don't even know. How many cars do I have? I, I don't know. One. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I do it to somebody else? Oh, that should be in there. What's that? Yeah, I left them in there, so. Well, they had one set of keys or I think that thing would slide down that thing. Slide down. Man, I hope not. It's a little wet. We're drive. It's going out. Yeah. <laughs> See what it does, man. It's a little bit more? Right there, good. <laughs> well, I've had one I towed one time when a guy had a metal trailer, and I came to a stop real fast because there was a cop at the light, yeah. and uh, I wasn't going to run it. No, oh, it's, it it's got groups. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. And so when I slammed the brakes on, I looked in the rear view mirror, and that car was coming at me on, on the trailer. Many times that we kind of already know. Uh, if, if it didn't have that, I probably wouldn't even slid out that thing, you know, when it rained. Yeah. Oh, especially in the rain, yeah. You gotta buy one. You can buy so many more cars with those. Oh, yeah. Yeah, locally it was great, but yeah, if I'm heading out to Vegas way. Oh, I've, been, I've been four hours away. I've been five hours away. Well, since I retired, I travel out that way. I drive them home. Yeah, I mean, we're like, we're going to break down. 